Hi guys, I'm just gonna kind of roll off the tongue here because I think that's I'm more natural uh, just going off the top of my head. There's a lot of uh moments and like brain farts, but what I was gonna say was so the video before this that you're gonna see the uh, kayak adventure, first adventure, didn't go that well. Well, I mean, good things happened. Got some cool shots of the lake and whatnot, and I got to uh, get some other baits and a wait for fish and whatnot, but didn't really go as planned. And that's because of this whole lockdown stuff is, is crazy. But what I can say is that what's gonna happen though now is that everything is, from what I can tell, from what I see, I mean, things are hopefully gonna go back to normal. They're gonna be able to beat this virus together as a people and a nation and a country, and we're gonna hopefully go back to normal. And so even like the military, we're going back to normal standards. We're gonna start working our full nine to five, which is great. Um, but then that also means that like my content of like, hiking and fishing and whatnot is actually going to start to go down a little bit because then I'm only going to be able to go on the weekends. That's fine. So that's where this video comes in. You're going to see the title and be like, wait, what? What is this? And that's because I'm going to have to adapt. And I know I just started and people are like, what is this channel turning into? Like, what are you even doing? It's like, first of all, I'm just uploading everything I want to and I can just to see what clicks. And secondly, going to be more efficient this way because I'm gonna be able to make better, I don't even know if better is the right word, but I'm gonna be able to make more interesting, different content this way with in-house stuff. Um, and so the title of this video is gonna be something along the lines of YouTube icon drawing or drawing for idiots or, or drawing after ages or something. Cause when I was a kid and my parents will attest to this is that I really like to draw and I really like to talking gibberish, but I like to draw stuff with colors and whatever, just portraits and cartoons and stuff. I was always that guy that was like, you had the notes in class and then there'd be like a ton of doodles. There'd be a ton of doodles around the edges of the pages and whatnot because class was not working for me. It didn't click. I, notes were taking was hard even when I'm in the military and stuff like that. But it's also, it's like, yeesh. Um, I'm about to run to the store, that's why I have the face mask on, because I want to get some nice paper, I want to, well, decent paper that doesn't, like, that doesn't have, this is from Dungeons and Dragons, it doesn't have, uh, graphs and stuff on it, so, uh, and I'm gonna draw, because I thought about it, I'm like, it's like, why are you doing that? There, there's a channel or a website I heard called Fiverr, where you can make, uh, not make, but you can ask people to like do YouTube banners and YouTube uh, icons and stuff. And then to that, I'm like, for me, I'm thinking long term. I'm thinking, well, what happens when I make or I ask somebody to make a art or a piece of art online? Now, there's bigger channels out there now that's like they make the art and if they use it in their, whether it's to put it on t-shirts or merch or whatever, then they get a deal going. But for me, just starting out, what happens if I want to make art down the line and all of a sudden they, they pull their rights and I don't know how the site works. Maybe it's like you make it and it's a one-off, you pay for it and then you can use it for whatever. But to me, I really wanted to make the icon myself because I think that would be more true to who I am. And starting this channel is like, I want it to be authentically me. Like I approve it. Kind of like if I get a sponsorship, obviously if I'm gonna, I'm gonna have to use it myself authentically, truly say my rawness about what I think about the product or whatever. It's like, did I want to do beef jerky uh, taste tests kind of a thing and maybe reach out to them when I get somewhere on this thing and be like, yo, this is actually really, really good or this is super salty and I don't like this. It's the same way with my art. I want to make, I want to make my YouTube icon touching my chest. I want to make my YouTube first icon at least, maybe there's somebody that's like a thousand times better at art, which I know there are, but I want to make my first icon for YouTube to, to, to show everybody that like I'm starting it literally from the ground up. But that, so that's what I want to do. And it's also because it'd be something cool. I can throw some cool EDM music in the background and test and mess with time-lapse stuff. Um, and so that's what I'm going to do. Bzz, do. So I'm going to go get some paper, go get some uh, coloring pencils and whatnot, and then I'm going to probably, uh, within the next few days, draw. I'm going to show you guys, and I'm going to upload it and just 
film myself with a time lapse and just me testing out different uh, ideas. And then in, after I get a few drawn up after a week or so, or maybe a few weeks, I'll, ha I'll ask you. And, I'll, and yes, the, I'll throw some graphics up. Yes, the, the outdoor videos and hiking and, and trying to learn how to fish are not gonna stop. It's just gonna be when we get back to normal schedules, I can't, I mean, I have a job. I still need to authentically work, obviously, at, in the military. Um, I will not be able to go, like I'm not gonna be able to wake up on Monday morning at 5 a.m. and drive out to a lake to fish at 6 a.m. That's not gonna happen. So I'm only gonna be able to go Saturdays and Sundays, which kind of sucks, but it's just, I, it's, you gotta, you gotta deal with how it works. I, mean, I gotta pledge my time through, so my contract through, obviously. I'm gonna upload this as one video and then I'm gonna make the next video of me going out and uh, getting all the stuff. But anyway, so that's what I wanted to do. This is like channel update, even though the channel's super new. Thank you to all the 20 subscribers so far in this last month that have uh, subscribed my parents and friends. That's very cool of you. But uh, yeah, so I wanted to throw this quick update on here. If you're trying to recommend it to your friends, like, oh yeah, this guy's just getting into outdoor stuff. He's just getting into fishing and he might be something cool someday, or it just takes one video. I was watching a podcast about these different fishing guys and outdoor guys that they were talking about their one, their first video, they got like 100,000 views and their first video that got them to a million views and all that stuff. And I know that's probably a year or so down the line. It could be sooner, I don't know. It's up to, it helps if you guys actually share, which I, liking and commenting and stuff is great as well. Thank you, I'm not denying that. But, uh, so yeah, I'm just gonna throw this up. Uh, to, to, this is the quick update. I'm not not doing outdoor videos. I'm just gonna have to be, <coughs> it's gonna be slowing down a little bit, even though it barely was on there to begin with, but I was trying to make a fishing one almost every other one or every one. Uh, but it's gonna be s less of those, probably once a week or so, because I'll probably only go up a Saturday or a Sunday, whether it's hiking or, or, or fishing. It's gonna be a lot of like, I say toys, but like drone reviews, stuff that I'm actually gonna be able to use because uh, I want to be able to use a drone for videography and all that and then the art and food tests because I really like beef jerky. I actually really do like beef jerky and uh, so all that stuff I will be making into their own separate videos. But uh, So thank you guys for the likes and the shares and the comments and I appreciate the views and uh, I'll catch you on the next one.